The global burden. <coughs> so what are these uh, waterborne diseases? And why are we st uh, studying them? The, the, the problem is he, uh, here is they are a burden to the public health. If we take, for example, uh, waterborne disease, they are being transmitted by uh, uh, water, contaminated water, you see. So this, uh, uh, these uh, diseases constitute a major, major problem in health, in our public health. So if you want to compare all the diseases of this world that cause death, this waterborne disease, they cause 4% of death, which is about 1.4 million death annually. So um, in these waterborne diseases, research has shown that children are most affected. And um, aquatic life, uh, such as runoff, loading of coastal waters with pathogens. For example, uh, if we look at a wastewater treatment plant, the example of the one that is in Hamburg, uh, uh, research for maybe two years ago, when I researched on this waterborne disease, is we found that after, we, we know that in the wastewater treatment plant, we undergo a series of purification and so on. So at the end, at the effluent, which is supposed to be flushed into the river, a lot of parasites were found in. Where are these parasites going to? Into the river. So we are going to know uh, more about it. And we talk about uh, soci uh, socioeconomic impact. How do these uh, parasites impact the social status of our well-being? When in people are affected with this parasite, some, the, the people who are working in agriculture, Maybe they don't go to the, to, to the farm again, and it lower their status. And if, if you are affected with this parasite, maybe you stay at home, you are supposed to go out and socialize, it costs a lot to you.